Hey, what's up, everybody? This is Pinarius. Welcome back to Resident Evil 3. The last episode with Carlos was intense. We had to protect Jill from a onslaught of zombies coming through the lobby of this building. And it was, like I said, intense. But Jill's woken up, and we need to, I guess, get out of Raccoon City before this place gets nuked. So Jill's finally up, and in the last episode, there were a bunch of places that we needed to open with uh, Jill's lockpick, so we're gonna try and find those and try not to get murdered. So we'll see how it goes. So we got this awesome pistol at the end of the last episode. It uses pistol bullets, so I'm not sure which one we're actually gonna be using, but I am gonna be carrying both. I did put the knife in here because the knife is pretty much useless, so we're not gonna really be using the knife. And I also put the flame rounds in here, because I'm not sure if I'm gonna be using Actually, no, I didn't put the flame rounds in here. I put my extra mine rounds in here. But we have the shotgun, we have the mine, the grenade launcher. So this is our setup for now. So let's go ahead and get out there. And let's see how it goes. All right, here we go. I don't know where Terry went. Oh, there's Terry. I sure as shit didn't. That was all Carlos. He carried you here and he treated you himself, crazy bastard. Where is he? He went underground. Bard stockpiled the vaccine, enough to give the city some hope. He thinks he can do this by himself. I'm going after him. Wait, did you see the broadcast? They're gonna blow the city sky high. I'm trying to get a hold of someone, anyone with the clearance to stop it. Leave this mess to him. He's a professional. So am I. Exactly. All right, let's see if there's... Guess I'm not talking you out of this. No, you are not. facilities underground, beneath this hospital. I've lost contact with Carlos, so expect the trouble. Ah, uh, now I understand why I need the knife. So that I can shank boxes. Obviously, the knife is not totally useless. So let's go ahead and grab the knife again. Even though I don't find much use for it besides shanking boxes. Let me go ahead and pop that. I'll pop it here. Maybe we'll play with the new pistol for this episode. If it uses too much ammo, then we probably won't end up using it too much. But yeah, I forgot about all my shankable boxes. Let's take a look around. Yeah, so this thing blew up last episode. Kind of dangerous. Glad it didn't murder everybody. But let's see if there's anything else around that we can possibly use before we move on. Yeah, I think I used everything when I was Carlos. Alright, Terry. Let's go. Okay. Not sure where all these shankable boxes came from. Alright, here we go. Okay, a lot of recoil. Hopefully I can find some ammo. Whoa, okay. Nice, are you dead? Alright, I'm gonna assume- Whoa! Oh, damn it. Okay, we gotta- We gotta get back into the rhythm of things. All right, Joe, back up. Okay, he's down. This place is absolutely infested. Come on, go down, lady. Okay, how's this room? This room is completely done. Let's see what's through here. I wonder if those, uh, those things... Those hunter baiters, whatever they are, are still around. Because that's going to suck. Alright. Let's go ahead and open this up. This thing has been super useful. What is this? Oh, are we getting a magnum soon? Oh, please. Give me a magnum. That's going to be great. Okay, there's something out here that we can get. Oh yeah, it's another box. So it looks like we're going to be dropping down somewhere soon. Okay, I think that hallway was clear. Yeah, that hallway is clear. We need to get that box in the in there. And all right, let's check out this place over here. Okay, that's all set. Okay, this is the testing room where that dude was dead. Yeah, he's dead. This looks like Nikolai's work. Yep, of course it is. Okay, was that the only thing in here? Yes, it was. Awesome. Okay, let's go.
Let's get the shotgun ready. You never know what we're gonna come across. Yep, I knew it. All right, come on, Jill. Damn it, I know, I know, I know. Oh, I thought I had the other rounds. Damn it. Okay, switch to the other rounds. Let's go back through here. Okay, are you coming through here? How's my health? All right, we're in caution. We can survive something. All right, let's put that there. And let's put that there. Okay, you're dead. Can I pick these up? Of course not. Really? That's just rude. Okay, let's go ahead and open this up. I'm absolutely terrible at this game, but it's been a hell of a lot of fun. Hopefully you guys have been enjoying it. But I told you guys I was going to be terrible at this game. Explosive ammo, nice. Okay, let's go. My health is still pretty good. We're going to have to take a trip back to the box. We'll probably go to the one that's upstairs. Let's see, is this room done? Good. Alright, let's get to those stairs. Alright, that was the hunt again. Alright, stairs are this way. Where was that box? Was that box over here? Let's see. Or was that box on the other side? Oh, I think that box is on the other side. Alright, so we're gonna have to go and jump out of that window over there. Alright. Back this way. Stairs. All right, Jill, let's do this. All right, let's see, is the mine launcher still full? Okay, it is. This sounds like... How are you still alive? Okay, this dude's been alive the entire time. Sounds like we still have another one of those, um, dudes. Okay. I think the safe room is this way. Come on, Jill. Okay. Two mine. Two mine launchers does it. Okay, this is not the room. Wrong room. But at least we know two of these does it. All right, we got to jump out of that window. That's the way we need to go. But first, I want to find the safe room and drop off this stuff. All right, let's hop in the safe room real quick, and then we'll jump out and get back up here. All right, everybody, we are back at it. So let's see if we can find that box. I'm pretty sure we need to jump out of the window over here so let's jump out of here let's see if that box is over here let's see okay no it's not here is it over here oh it's over here okay we still haven't figured out how to get over there yet all right i'm gonna make my way back upstairs i'll figure this out okay i think there's a locker in this room there's a lot of bodies in there's a lot of bodies in this room yeah there should be a locker oh Oh, you're actually up. Oh, you're all up. That's great. Okay. Jill? God damn it. Come on. I checked all these bodies before. Of course you're up now when Jill has to actually do something. That's great. Alright, Jill. Let's do this. Okay, one down. All these bodies before. Nothing up now, of course. Okay, this gun uses so much ammo. Okay. Anybody else getting up? I know, you're probably gonna get up soon. Let's go ahead and pick this lock. Use this. Pick this lock, and we're gonna switch back to my other pistol. This gun uses a ton of ammo. Okay. Um, let's go ahead and shortcut this back up there. Okay, we're good. All right, is this room done? This room's done. Okay, perfect. All right, let's get out of here. And I just healed myself. And we're back to 
where we were before. All right, what room do we need to check next? We need to go back to the sick room. So turn and go to the nurse's station. All right, we can't go that way. Nurse's station. That is this way. All right, Joe. Let's see. I think it is in this room. Yeah. I don't think we killed everything in here. Oh, hello. Okay, you're done. What did I leave in here? Ah, high-grade gunpowder. Okay, cool. This room should be done. Alright, let's get to the treatment room, which is this way. You guys are all dead? Yep, Carlos took care of you guys. How am I doing for ammo? Four bullets to my name. Beautiful. You guys are dead, right? Yeah, good. Okay, good. We got another locker here. Go ahead and pop this open. I'm glad there's no higher level locks that we've seen so far. More mag ammo. Where's my magnum? Okay, and we need to get into the treatment room, which should be clear. Explosive ammo A. Okay, so we can still make something. Okay, this place is all clear. Awesome. All right, I'm going to make a run back to that other room, and then we're going to come back in here. I'm going to go back and store this stuff, and then we'll make a... Actually, I can think... I think I can go this way. Okay, I think I found another door, but I'm not exactly sure where this door leads to. Looks like it leads to a whole other section of the hospital, but I kind of want to clear this courtyard first. So I'm going to try to figure out how to get to this section of the courtyard before I get to through this padlock door. So give me a quick second and we'll be back. What's this? Spencer Memorial Pamphlet. Welcome to Spencer Memorial Hospital, the heart of Raccoon City's healthcare and forefront of science. Spencer Memorial's hospital. Spencer Memorial Hospital was meticulously designed by the Spencer Foundation to serve as the backbone of medical care throughout the region. In addition to our state-of-the-art outpatient wing and spacious inpatient wing, we boast one of the country's largest research wings where we conduct clinical trials for new drugs that will change the face of medicine across the United States and the world. Okay, all right, so I'm gonna see if I can get to that chest and then we'll get moving. I think I can squeeze by. Oh, wow, okay, so of course Joe can squeeze through here. All right, let's go ahead and try this. I forgot that Joe is a lot smarter than Carlos is. So this one place that Carlos couldn't get by, Joe can actually get by. So I think this is actually the spot I needed to be in. And I didn't even try here because Carlos couldn't get here. All right, here we go. I think I actually got the spot now after like five minutes of searching. I think this might be the Magnum. So let's go ahead and open this. Yep, it's the Magnum. Ooh, Lightning Hawk. 44E AE Lightning Hawk. Guaranteed to give you a headache. There we go. Kendo's Armory. Collect all the weapons in the campaign. Oh, okay, so this is the final weapon. Alright, let's read this. 8 round capacity, 44 AE mag. It's gas-operated action, which is unusual for a semi-auto hand cannon, gives it both power and accuracy. Okay. Wow, that sounds awesome. Let's uh go ahead and equip this bad boy to the knife slot. I only really need the knife if I need to shank a box, so we should be good. Wow. Hopefully hopefully this thing has some upgrades because it takes a long while to square its target. Alright, let's get back to where we need to be and then we can get the hell out of here. I think we are officially done with this area. Alright, I'll meet you guys back at that padlock door after I make my way back to the safe room and grab my mag ammo because I've just been storing it. Alright, we'll be ready in a quick second, guys. Oh, of course. Of course. As soon as I get the Magnum, this dude comes out of nowhere. All right. Here we go. Oh, whoa. How do you like me now? One shot to the face and you're dead? Holy crap. Joe Valentine, badass. Wow. Of course. How are you still alive with these things running around? 
I'm never taking this gun off. Absolutely never. Okay, I'm so glad I actually used that spray before I started that fight. Okay, well, we're putting you away because you used too much ammo. We're gonna keep you. And let's go ahead and... I don't even know what I came here to do. Okay, yeah, bag ammo, obviously. And I think we're ready to go. Yeah, let's get back to... Oh, how did we make... I think we needed two high grade to make mag ammo. Yeah, we can't make any right now. So I think we're ready to go. Let's get back to that door and actually let's get on with this episode. Because <laughs> I've been looking for the spot for that damn... For this damn box forever. But it's definitely worth it. All right, see you later, Terry. One shot to the face was all it took. All right, here we go. Is that the last for the lockpick? It was the last for the lockpick. Wow. All right, lockpick's done. You've done, you've done me proud, lockpick. All right, let's go. Let's get the shotgun. I feel like this is like a shotgun type of area, seeing as I only have one pistol bullet. Okay, shankable box. Let's go ahead and shortcut that. Gunpowder. Of course I get gunpowder when the rest of my gunpowder is in the thing. Okay, let's get my magnum back real quick. Okay, let's go. That room was done, right? Yeah. I have a feeling that we're going to get accosted by Nemesis. Because Nemesis is like never dead. And then you, we still have Nikolai to worry about. Oh boy. And they're giving me all this explosive ammo stuff. Which means we're probably going to be using the mine again. Or the, uh, the launcher. Oh boy. Alright, here we go. And we're on this lift. Which is a small space and they love to give me boss fights in a small space. If Resident Evil 2 is anything to go by. Let's get the mine launcher. The, yeah, the mine launcher ready. <sighs> okay. How is it no one in the hospital ever noticed all this? Holy crap. This is all connected to the freaking hospital? What the hell? Umbrella is absolutely ridiculous. Okay, we'll grab you. I think we're done. Yeah, we're done with this. Is there a lock here or something? What was that on the thing here? Oh, it's the lever. Obviously. Okay, so what's next? Am I climbing something? Oh. Grab this and then I think I can get up top. I increased my field of view, but I can't really see all that difference. Let me know if you guys can see a difference between this video and the last one. All right, let's go. Oh, safe room. Nice. Just what I was looking for. All right, anything for me here? Hit pouch. Okay. That's always welcome. What else do we got? We got a box here and we have something to read. Elevator notice. To all employees, we've identified an issue with the electrical box where concurrent use of heavy machinery overloads it and causes the fuses to blow. If you encounter this problem and can't get the elevator running, please stay calm and gather fuses from the subgenerators situated around the warehouse and use those to restore power from the main generator as quickly as possible. Okay, so it looks like we're going to be gathering fuses very soon. Okay, let's go ahead and uh, toss some of this stuff in here. I think I'm going to, I need pistol ammo. So I think I'm going to use this and make some pistol ammo. All right, good. We got some pistol ammo and let's go ahead and store that. Now two bees make acid rounds. I haven't used acid rounds. I'm not sure if they're good against anybody real quick. So I'm not, or yet. So I'm not going to make anything with that just yet. Okay. So I think, I think we're all set here. Yeah, we have mag ammo. Yeah, we're all set. Okay. Drop a save and get moving. Come on. There we go. 
All right, let's go. This room's done. Lift lever, lift lever. Yeah, we're good. All right, let's go. Whoa. Oh, Nikolai. Hi, Nikolai. How are you? We got company, Jill. Let's reload. Things are going to get very interesting. Where's Nemesis? You don't want to say anything, Jill? Yeah, see, going in there seems like a trap. And I don't respond very nicely to traps. <sighs> Fine. If I have no other choice, I guess I'll walk clearly into the trap. I guess I'll be stupid. Fine. All right, Jill. Let's be stupid and walk into the cl very clear trap. Guess we'll get the shotgun. I'm gonna shoot you first. I just hope you know that. Yeah. Oh no, the fuse broke. I must admit, I respect your tenacity. But I'm afraid our games end here. <clears throat> you think this is over? Alright, fuses. We need three fuses. What the Okay. Tell me that killed you. Can we not? What the hell? Jill, Jill, move, Jill, move. Oh God, Jill, please. Okay, so a shotgun shot to the face in like five hits to the head did nothing. Okay, let's uh, let's try explosive rounds. Jill, please, Jill, please. Okay, are you kidding me? Are we done? You gotta be kidding me. What do I do? Okay. Yeah, just uh, slow down for a second. Come on, hurry up, hurry up, hurry up, hurry up, please. This thing is unstoppable. Come on. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Okay, we're in danger, which means this needs to happen. Wow. That was, uh, I was not expecting that thing to be sort of invulnerable. Okay, we got a fuse. And we need this to be here. Box. Box. Okay, and we got both of those. Okay, we have a ladder here. Let's go, Jill. Come on. Come on. Okay. There's Whoa, dog. Shit. Jill. Jill, please. Shit. Get the shotgun out. Okay, that's one. Come on. That's two. Oh, wow. Okay, we're gonna need some health stuff. Handgun ammo, good. Go ahead and reload, because that thing took a lot of ammo. How's our health? Our health is not good. We need that green herb. Do we still have first aid? No, we don't. Shit. Okay, this is another lift. Okay, we could go that way, but that way... Looks like a dead end. God. Ooh. Alright, here we go. Don't panic. Okay, this way. Oh, a dead end. No. Nope, not a dead end. We can get through here. We have another red herb there. Whew, just relax. We got this. Grab that. We're not going back through there. Let's get this. Alright, hit that. We gotta go up here for a second, I think. Okay, that went down. What does this do? Oh, it's a door. Open this for- Oh, hello, boys. Okay. What do I need over there? 
employee memo. Sure, let's read this. September 12th, admitted to into male 45, female 32, discarded male 60, female 89. September 15th, admitted to into males 55, 19, female 51, discarded female 76, returned female 8, uninfected. September 22nd, admitted to N2, males 25, 22, 15, female 16, 21, 29, discarded, 6 male specimens, 9 female specimens, disposals trending upward daily, preemptively dispose of any over 30 years of age. September 24th, nightly transfer observed by nurse, admissions to underground facility temporarily halted. Okay. This room is not done. Come on, shotgun shells, please. Open this, because this is going to help me do something. Oh, my safe room. Yes. Perfect. Okay. I need you to take out and combine with you. You guys can go back. And where are my other herbs? Okay. You combine with you. All right, I'm going to not use that right now. All right, we should be good. And just to be safe, we're going to we're going to do this. I want to say this killed it. We could use try acid rounds. You know what? Let's let's try to make acid rounds. Let's see if acid rounds do anything. A mixed with I don't know what to mix that with. I think B mixed with what? Oh, B with B to make acid rounds. Let's give that a try. Let's see if that kills it. Combine this with you. Acid rounds. Cool. Store this. Alright, so. Let's go ahead and put in some acid rounds. Let's see if this kills our new friend. Who it did not get back up. Okay, cool. So something killed it. Alright, back this way. Alright, so we put down this okay let's get back down there i think we need to get over there all right let's go jill we got this oh box oh whoa hello shell holder shotgun allows for fast reload speed okay don't mind if i do combine this with this did this get even bigger okay it didn't you never know. It could have gotten bigger. Alright. Up we go. Okay. That is faster. Okay. What's this? Handgun ammo. Okay. I can take that. Can I make it over there? Okay. I can. Cool. But I can't do anything over here. I need to figure out how to activate that platform, I think, and get what's over there. Okay, fair enough. I need you to stop groaning. That would be great. I think I need to get back into this room. And then make my way back over there, maybe? Alright. I'm gonna go down here. I don't know why just yet. Hopefully I don't get killed. Gunpowder. Oh god, no. Okay. Um, where's my magnum? Shortcut this down. Please stay down. Oh, of course not. Okay. So that magnum shot I had before was the perfect magnum shot. That one was not. Oh, we're running out of space. Shit. Yep, we're definitely running out of space. I had to go back to my thing real quick. All right. So that was another fuse. We got to find the next fuse. If this light, <laughs> I have this light in my room that will not stop flickering and it's driving me insane. Okay, we're back here. Let's go ahead and store this gunpowder. Uh, mine rounds. I'm going to keep those. Let's store those. Alright, I think we're good for now. 
All right, let's get back at it. So we need to find out where the last fuse is. Does this tell us where the fuse is? Left lever, left lever, fuse box. Okay, we didn't make it to the surveillance room. I wonder if... Let's see what we can do with what we have. Okay, we still have a friend down there. I guess we can try these acid rounds. Does that do anything to you? Do you slowly die? You don't slowly die. All right, we could try mine rounds. Nah, you don't even die from that. All right, let's get back down there. Okay, wait, no, we can't go that way. We have to jump down this way. Oh, well that did something. Uh, I think we need to get into that room there based on the map. Is that right? Yeah, that is right. Ah, uh, damn. All right, let's get down there. I want to try something. Come on, Jill. All right. Put these fuses in. All right, let's see. Let's put this one in. Use and this one. And we just need the first fuse, which I think is in this place back here. But we can't get in there just yet. Oh, damn. All right, let's uh, start this rodeo again. We're just going to play Ringer on the Rosie with this guy. I don't want to waste any more ammo. Can you use the... All right, <laughs> I thought he was going to use the machine for a second. That would have been something, huh? Come on, Jill. One per customer, buddy. Okay, so how do we get into that room? There has to be a secret way into this room, I'm guessing. Because it says there's a few fuse box there, unless there's another fuse box I'm missing. Hmm. I don't know. We'll figure it out. Alright, let's keep moving. Let's switch these out. I still think we need to get this moving. I feel like that's our next best bet. So I'll try to get this moving. All right, kennels. We have already been past the kennels. We've been in there. All right, let's uh, check over here. He, he made that fall. Okay, I think I might have figured something out. I think this one will control that one in front of us. Yes, it does. Awesome. Okay, so I figured out how to get over here. And I think maybe there's a... Yeah, it looks like there's a ladder back here. That might lead us to that other side. Alright. Let's go ahead and hop down here. Oh, boy. This should be interesting. Okay. So far, so good. Is there anything back... That sounded primal. Okay. Oh, hello. I don't have anything for you. Okay. All right, boys. Okay, this is ridiculous. Alright, so, um, let's take this, switch to this. Alright, let's take out these guys first. Get in here. Jill, please. Reload, 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 Jill. Fast reload. Do it now. Okay, we've killed him. Holy crap. Woo. Okay, this is no time for this. We're just gonna have to use the shotgun. I was trying to be ammo conscious. Alright, maybe we can do it now. You know what? Let's do this. Whew, good lord. That was ridiculous. Just stay down. This game is ridiculous. <laughs> I love this game, but it's so ridiculous. All right. 
Okay. Fuse box. We got all the fuses. Holy shit. <laughs> Alright, let's grab this. Okay, let's get up here. And I think we should be good. Alright, this should lead us back to where we need to go. We should be able to just go through the safe room here. I don't think anything got back up in here. Let's get this ready just in case. Mine round should be good for at least one blow. Okay, good. You're still dead. What killed you? Was it the explosive rounds that killed you? It might have been the explosive rounds. Which means I'm probably just going to go ahead and grab the explosive rounds again. Alright. So much gunpowder. Alright, I'm going to make some ammo real quick and then we'll get on our way. All right, everybody, so we got all the fuses and we got what we need. I think it was the explosives rounds that killed this guy, but I don't think we actually need to fight this dude. So let's get over here and pop this fuse in, of course. Jill? Oh, come on, dude. I got away from you. All right. How do you like me now? Screw you guys. Jill, it's no time to reload, goddammit. <laughs> Let's go ahead and pop that in there. Come on. Please. Thank you. Man, they these guys take a lot of damage. Alright. Of course he got away. What was he doing in here? Very good question. Uh let's see if we can figure out what he was doing in here. What's this? Oh, extended barrel for my magnum. Let's see, what does this do for my magnum? A custom part for the 44 AEL Hawk. This bull barrel reduces recoil and imparts extra speed to bullets, increases damage. Well, that sounds awesome. Wow, look at that. <laughs> That's amazing, and it doesn't increase the uh, the space it takes up. That's a, uh, that's that's awesome. Unfinished activity log. Infiltrated RC. Disturbances are sporadic. Commencing mission. Observed five RPD officers engaging a pack of twenty strong. Officers annihilated in twenty minutes. Test run at university. Diverted pack. Inclined canines to campus 64 percent infection and conversion to two hours no survivors successful rendezvous with mv platoon will make first attempt at dawn diverted pack towards command post result night skirmish in confined area with large number of combatants video attached end of skirmish seven survivors unknown bioweapon deployed at point d18 tracking it per orders it appears to be on the hunt got eyes on two stars a male infected and female bioweapon is pursuing the female female jv has made contact with mv platoon bioweapons appearance and behavior are consistent with project n investigating observed bioweapon wielding conventional weapons it seems to be strongly fixated on terminating jv and knows the city layout evidence it can be imprinted Metamorphosis in the bioweapon triggered by a hostile encounter with JV. Video attached. JV has been infected and is non-responsive. Collected samples per orders. Over 17 hours has elapsed since JV's exposure to the virus. Conversion has been slow, suggesting she may be resistant. Vaccine recovered and administered to JV by CO, a soldier in the MV platoon. JV expected to be fit for combat approximately 20 hours post-exposure. It seems clear the bioweapon is Project N. Contact with JV causes it to change and evolve. Will induce further encounters to obtain more precise data. Interesting. So they've been throwing Nemesis against me in order to force it to evolve. But I don't know why. What's the purpose? Hi, Terry. Oh, Tyrell, my bad. I got through. They're willing to negotiate. 
Did you get bit? You got bit. Call up the strike if, and this is one big ass if. We can deliver the vaccine to them before they launch. How long do we have? Hours. Joe, we're Maybe. gonna have to shoot this dude. Then let's not waste one more second. This way. Why would I go with this guy? All right, looks like we got a little bit more time, so let's uh let's follow this guy who may obviously be infected. He seems a bit too hurt for my liking. All right, actually, you know what? I think we might want to end it here. This was a pretty good run. Um, I know this was a shorter one than I usually do, but I think this is a good place to stop. I'm not sure what's going on with uh, Tyro here, but I think he's obviously hurt some way. But in the next one, we'll see what else this game has to offer and whether or not we'll have to end up shooting Tyro or he'll be some, some fight down the line. But let me know what you guys thought of this episode and of my terrible, terrible performance at this game. But like I said, that's going to bring us to the end of this episode. If you guys enjoyed it, please leave a like and consider subscribing. If you didn't, however, leave a comment. Let me know why. Thank you all for watching and I will see you in the next one. Later.